what is up welcome back to the channel and we are back at it again with another episode of split guys if you guys don't remember what happened in the last episode um the gang came together because they found a necklace um and they've been trying to piece together who boss could be but it turns out the boss is actually two people a woman and a man so we're right on one of them it is a woman because um Arjun guessed that it was a woman between the ages of 18 and 25 um so we have that but we also don't know that there's two people and one of them is a man um also boss got chris because the boys went um looking for something if i remember correctly and they ended up in one of the archive rooms and boss locked them in there um chris went the other way looking for something or he went to the bathroom or something like that and he ended up getting caught by boss and boss beat him up and they beat him up pretty bad um as far as we can tell um that is all that i can remember so far i can't remember what happened with the girls the girls the girls just enjoyed some peace and quiet like they went to the beach to just have some girl time and just be quiet to just be like this is a situation we're here we're stuck so how the hell do we get out of here um, essentially is what happened with the girls um yeah that is all that i can think of right now so let's just jump into the story and see what is the tea guys um this is just them the two bosses talking and they're just they have something planned tomorrow and it is for daniel so daniel is their next victim for tomorrow so here we go um, and also, the girls found something. No, the guys found something. I think. I don't know. Anyway, so just jump in. Can you please stop ignoring us? We never ignored you in the first place. We've had a hectic day. We'll talk later. Friends don't keep secrets. Fine, be alone. We don't keep secrets. I know what you both mean, but friends don't keep secrets. Cut it, Kara. Hey, lower the attitude. I'm just trying to figure out what happened that shook you guys so badly. Kiara. I always fuck up her name. Ignore him, I'll tell you. But Faye, don't freak out, okay? Why? What happened? God, I don't know how to say this. Spit it out, Daniel. Chris went to the bathroom and he got lost and Boss got to him first. They kicked the shit out of him in the stomach and now he's bleeding. Where is he? I need to see him right now. He's resting up in his room. I cleaned him up a bit. Do we at least know why they beat him? We don't. Chris hasn't woken up yet. As if mental torture wasn't enough, they're going to be physical too? Oh no. I know Arjun was mean to me, but he just went through such a scary incident. He, should, he could have scarred anyone. What to do? Say you're sorry. Don't tell him to stop being sad. Tell him to stop being sad. Hey, bitch. <laughs> Man the fuck up. <laughs> no, we're sorry. Because the girls really didn't know. So, I mean, it is it is that they're like, they just think they're being annoying when in reality, the boys really just went through something traumatic. Sorry for being a bitch, Arjun. Everything is going so wrong and we're not even close to getting out and it's scary. And that doesn't, but that doesn't give me the right to scream at you. Sometimes it's good to be the bigger person, isn't it? <laughs> it's my fault too. I should have just told you, but thank you for apologizing. And how do you guys end up in that room? We went to the room where we found Chris unconscious, so we decided to check it out. But boss locked us in there and took our phones, too. So we waited until you guys showed up. They took your phones? I have mine. Mine, too. Oh, God. At least some of us have our phones. But it's the third day, Leo. All our phones are dead. Oh, we'll never believe what we found in there. Who's going to tell them? You tell them, let Arjun tell them. Um, we'll let Daniel tell him since he's going to have a rough, <laughs> he's going to have a rough day tomorrow. I'll explain. So we found a letter in there from a woman to someone. I think they were lovers or something. The woman's name was Rose and she wanted to deliver some good news to someone called EK. Again, we don't know who they are. Don't worry, we'll keep searching. We're bound to find something. Exactly. Boss is also human who's capable of making mistakes. And thank you for telling us, Daniel. Arjun's like, please. So what should we do now? Can we try to analyze that letter? 
It's no use. Trust me, we tried. So many names, so many pictures. How do we know what is true and what isn't? Guys, where's Leo? Oh, shoot. We should make sure Boss doesn't beat him up, too. Quick, let's split up. We'll be able to cover more ground. Daniel, will you come with me? Of course, Kiara. We're searching the library. Come on, Raz. Okay, we'll search the hallways. Oh, Lord. Leo! This is a big-ass library. Oh, look, there's a computer here. Hmm. It's not switched off. Did Boss use it? Maybe. Let's see if we can find out what Boss searched for last. We're supposed to be searching for Leah. Yes, but if we find some leverage against Boss here, they'll release Leah. Uh-huh. Fine. All right, let's see what we have here. Pan across the screen to read. When you're done reading, click the tick button. Okay, we got Orlando Mayor Mr. Bruce Young has been reported that his Faye, that his daughter Faye Young has been missing for three days. She was last seen in the Rosewood Airport wearing the above outfit. If found, please contact Officer Adam Long for a reward of $1 million. Hey, loves, thank you for reading till here. I love you so much. Have a beautiful day. Uh, gosh. I think that's it. We can't click anywhere else, can we? No. So, hold up. She's Faye Wong? Oh, my God. Why wouldn't she tell us that? I thought she was an open book. Yeah, so much for being the nice girl. I knew she was hiding something. Relax. Oh, the Wi-Fi's on. Quick, try for a call to help. Okay. Great. Just great. Boss is probably watching this, too. Of course they are. Ugh. What do you want to do about Faye? Hmm, I'm not sure yet. You think we should wait for everyone to come and then ask her? Um, wait until everybody comes and then ask. Because if we wait until she says something, she ain't going to ever say nothing. As much as I want to ask her, I think we should wait. We should let everyone listen to what she has to say. Fine. Let's resume our search then. What's wrong? I think I'm just so tired. I don't know how much longer I can do this. It's mentally and physically exhausting and I... Do you want to talk about it? Open up a little bit, brush it off. Um, we'll open up just a little bit. Um, it shows you're comfortable around him. Cute. I couldn't sleep last night, not one bit. I keep thinking this is how my life is going to end. Trapped and tortured by an unknown person. I still have so much to do, so much to achieve. And hearing you both talk about what happened to Chris scares the shit out of me. What if that happens to me? And then I went on to thinking that we're all taking our lives for granted, aren't we? One second we're alive and the next we're dead. We have to make the most of our lives before we... Death is something that really scares me and I just... Silence. He didn't say a word. He was just listening very intently. Did I make a mistake by opening up to him? I ran it too much, didn't I? Oh, period. Wow, I did not expect that. This feels nice. Daniel will remember that you opened up. I absolutely love listening to you, Kiara. So don't ever think that you ran it too much. I And I feel honored that you chose to share such a personal thing with me. Don't worry, I'll make sure that we get out here alive, safe and sound. Daniel, I... Shh. Let's stay here for a bit. I like it. Thank God he felt the same way. Are we disturbing something? Uh-oh. Arjun did not look happy. I thought we were searching for Leo, not cuddling. Yeah, sorry. We were just having a moment. Let's go. Hey, Arjun. <laughs> I know we've only been here for a little while, but we've been spending a lot of time with each other. So I wanted to ask, do you like him? What do you like Daniel? This is not your final choice. No, I don't. Maybe I do. I mean, maybe. I mean, maybe I do. I don't know for sure. As much as that hurts me, I have to accept it. And I secretly pray that you'll give me a chance. Thank you for understanding, Arjun. He's cute when he's jealous. Leo! 
Like, how the hell you get snatched up next to us? Meanwhile, let me out. Please, I'm claustrophobic. I've already been locked once. Choose somebody else. Please don't do this. What are you doing, Leo? Think. Focus. Maybe I can look around this room to find something useful. There are seven objects in this room which you can collect. Pay on the screen to find them. After you're done, click on the tech mark. This will help you in the future, so make sure you collect all the items. Okay, um, let us click. Gained weapon, a pitchfork, okay. Um, we got a torch. We got a bow and arrow, okay, a bat, okay knife okay another bat and a gun okay i think that was seven was that seven i don't really know pitchfork just one torch two three four five there's another bat here somewhere I think I got everything. I think I got everything. We're gonna assume I got everything. And if I didn't, whoops. Are you sure you collected seven items? Yeah, I guess, complete. These are some good weapons. Did boss know they were here? Whatever, I'm gonna use them. Now I just need some place to store them. This bag is perfect. I did something good, uh, finally. I can show Arjun that I'm not useless. Um, now I just need to get out of here. Bang on the door. Cause the walls could be soundproof, but let me out. I have to hear banging at least. Let me out. He's here guys. Leo, I'm here. They're not hitting each other, haha. -ha. They all just knock, knock each other out. <laughs> Why are all their doors so strong? Well, 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 look what we have here. Leo, I know you're claustrophobic, so I have a proposal for you. Tell these four your secret and I'll let you out. Please, please let me out. I can't tell. You won't listen to me. I know just the thing. Please, it's too much. I could feel the spaces closing in every second. My head started woozing and I was losing consciousness. On top of that, the smoke made it worse. Now I can't even see. Just spit it out, Leo. Your life is more important. Leo, please. You'll die otherwise. I can't see. Oh my God. I cannot let him die. Uh, scream at him, guilt trip him. Uh, guilt trip him? Um, cruel tactic, but needed. I mean, it got us the clue because I'm like screaming at him might not really do anything because we're all screaming at him. So maybe guilt trip him. Leo, please tell us if we get killed and it did and it's because you didn't spill. You won't want that on your conscience, right? You're right. Fine. I'll tell you my secret. Why would you guilt trip him? Well, girl, what else was I supposed to do? I stole money from a bank. Three million dollars total. Damn, bitch. From Mayor Wong's account. Bitch. <gasps> uh-uh. How did the episode go in like, girl, he stole money from Faye Daddy. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yeah. See, now this is getting good. We, we about to. Okay. Okay. So, we finna start making connections. The connect things are finna start connecting. Because we just found out. That Faye's daddy is the mayor. And now we know that Leo stole $3 million from him. So that's how they're connected. We're going to start getting connections, y'all. It's going to start getting crazy. But that's all that I have for you today, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more, of course. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Our little secret. Keep it